The Model FF balloon forming machine from Blockwise Engineering drastically improves manufacturing cycle times through innovations in tooling setup, operator ergonomics, and recipe runtime. The induction module system allows operators to quickly perform tooling changeovers without the use of hand tools. With the machine powered off, push the module release button to disconnect the module from the machine base. To attach a different module, simply adjust the telescoping actuator, connect the module mounting hook to the mating hook on the machine, and push forward to click the module into place. The molds for the Blockwise Balloon Former are custom-made three-part molds that are designed to work with our uniquely modular system. To attach the quick connect holder to the right end plug, retract the sleeve and insert the end plug into the chuck. This assembly can then be inserted into the carrier on the right side of the module. To assemble the rest of the mold, first insert the end plug, then the spacer, into the left side of the mold center before inserting the mold holder. When the o-ring is properly seated, the mold holder should fit tightly with a small gap between the holder lip and the mold center. The arrow will always point toward the right side of the mold, which will first be inserted into the left side of the module. To insert the assembly, hold the mold latch in the open state and insert the mold in the direction indicated by the arrow. In addition to the mold and module, the operator will need to install a tube grabber seal that is sized for the Parison neck diameter. From the provided seal kit, select the seal with the smallest hole that the Parison can easily fit into. Each seal is paired with a corresponding washer. On the tube grabber, press and hold the button, then rotate the cover counterclockwise to remove it. Place one washer into the cover, then push the seal in until fully seated. Reinstall the cover and rotate clockwise until the button clicks into place. With the tooling setup complete, the machine is ready to run a balloon forming cycle. Open the desired recipe on the run screen and press the start button to move the grippers into the loading position. This will begin the Parison loading process. Following the instructions displayed on the screen, feed the Parison through the installed mold until it stops against the left side end plug. Then place the tail into the channel on the left gripper. When the optical sensor is triggered, it will automatically close the sealing piston. If the Parison is not fully sealed, push the open button on the HMI and readjust the tube. Once sealed, feed the other side of the Parison through the right end plug, then move the carrier forward until the end plug is fully seated against the mold center. Again, following the instructions on screen, push the start button to move the grippers and center the Parison inside the mold. Make sure to keep tension on the Parison while placing the tail into the channel on the right gripper. Similar to the left gripper, when the optical sensor is triggered, the piston will close. This gripper will hold the Parison during stretching without collapsing the tube. Finally, insert the tail into the tube grabber. This will provide high pressure nitrogen to the Parison once the recipe has started. The Parison is now loaded and the recipe is ready to start. Push the start button a third time to begin the programmed recipe. During the cycle, all process data is output on the run screen, including mold temperature and balloon pressure, as well as left and right gripper position and force. Due to the induction heating system, molds can be heated to and cooled down from forming and heat set temperatures in a matter of seconds. The Blockwise Balloon Former will run most balloon processes three to five times faster than conventional machines. Once the recipe cycle is complete, the balloon can be removed by following the instructions displayed on the screen. Cut the tubing on both sides of the module, then push the start button to move the right gripper to the clearance position. Finally, pull the in-plug carrier away from the module and remove the balloon from the mold. <laughs>